The president of Ukraine Volodymyr Zelensky continues to invoke the world community to cut ties with Russia. He recently made a speech at a meeting of American deputies, where he said that if we want completely isolate Russia, some cities need to sever ties with Russian cities and stop calling them twin cities. Zelensky, speaking after the vice president in front of the deputies, criticized Chicago, Jacksonville, Portland, San Diego, and San Jose for maintaining ties with cities in Russia. He said those relationships should be terminated. What do those ties give you? Probably nothing, Zelensky said, noting that Russia was thus given a chance to be a leader in the global community. According to the president of Ukraine, we need to take this feeling away from Russia. Zelensky told the audience what the Russian army is doing to the peaceful cities of Ukraine. According to him, some of the deadliest Russian missiles are developed and manufactured in Ekaterinburg, which is still the twin city of San Jose. Meanwhile, one of the Russian brigades that committed atrocities against Ukrainian civilians in Buka came from the Khabarovsk region of Russia, and the city of Khabarovsk is still the twin city of Portland. According to Zelensky, to restore normal life in Buka and the municipality of Buka, about 2,000 buildings need to be rebuilt. These are ordinary houses, ordinary schools, sports complexes, and medical facilities. Zelensky also invoked U.S. deputies to help rebuild Ukraine and help the country rebuild cities liberated from the Russian occupiers. Earlier this year, Chicago announced that it was cutting ties with Moscow, which it had had since 1997, but not permanently. Earlier this year, local San Jose media reported that the city's leadership had decided to maintain ties with Yekaterinburg. As of June 3, the websites of Portland, San Diego, and Jacksonville's twinning programs continue to feature Russian partners. Plenty of American cities have sister cities in different countries. And even in the Russian Federation, which usually accuses the United States and the West of being hostile. Although partnerships may include business and political exchanges, the relationships are mostly symbolic and sometimes run by local nonprofit organizations. However, Zelensky, addressing deputies 100 days after Russia invaded his country, said it was wrong to give Russia even the slightest shred of credibility. Don't make excuses and don't maintain relations with Russia, said Zelensky, whose speech drew applause from audience and city employees gathered in Reno. And please don't let those who have become murderers call your cities twin cities.